Good morning, morning from a sea day. It's late. A princess sea day of sea dayness. Of sleepiness. Yeah, we slept till like 10. We needed Almost. it. <laughs> um, but we're gonna jump out, probably grab a little bite from International Cafe, mm -hmm. and then there's some cool stuff that's going on today. Yeah, hopefully. Hopefully. We'll see what we can get We'll into. try to do a lot of cool stuff, or at least a little bit of cool stuff. Yeah, either way, we'll do something. <laughs> So let's roll out. All right. I'm ready. I'm hungry. Yeah. I want coffee. Yeah, that too. <laughs> <All right. laughs> Ooh la la. What have we today? There's fruits and yogurts. Sandwiches. Um, an egg, muffin, zucchini, and feta. Mmm. Uh, blueberry yogurt. There's our sandwiches and smoothie options, including some Mick muffins. And of course, a pastry case down there. Yep. All right, there is Dee's little egg bite and yogurt and an orange. I ended up with what they called a muesli cake or something with chocolate on it, because I don't know, and one of those McMuffins. Right. Gonna see if we can jump on the app now. Order coffee. If it works, and <laughs> order coffee, because the line was kind of long, and I'm just curious to see, you know, may as well order it using smart technology. <laughs> We'll use yours. Yeah, probably. maybe mine's being smarter. <laughs> I think we're gonna break bad and get a cappuccino, a cafe latte, just to see how it goes. There's all kinds of stuff you can order in the app. A lot of it's free. Well, there's like beverages, there's a coffee and tea section. This is where you can like chat with, I guess, guest services. Food to be delivered. You know, here's like, hey, what's on there? There's a fruit plate you can get, some guac and chips and stuff, and they'll deliver it wherever you need it delivered. Ooh, casino stuff, merchandise. Here's where you can request extra pillows and you know, face masks, hangers, ice. Some cool stuff happening with the app. Man, the app has failed us this morning. Our order went all the way through the processing phase and then all of a sudden it said delivered. And I knew not to panic because last time we yeah. used it on Crown, our order would show up about two minutes after it was marked delivered. But after about 10 minutes, we were like, oh, let's go check and see on our order. Because it, it never showed up and they didn't seem to have it. So we walked up, we've reordered, and hey, we're going to get some coffee. Yeah. Anyway, fun, fun, fun. Happy. I don't think it existed. It was weird, like Maybe the act complete. It's Roy. Roy was making the coffee. If you know Baltimore Roy, that's a throwback, isn't it? Baltimore Roy was making the coffee this morning, but they they booted him. He got fired. So I know he, he better does not need to work in the go back to making pizza. Mm -mm. No, anyway. We're still waiting. Yeah. All right, we got some iced coffee excitement. We're gonna jump up to deck six now. We're gonna check out the Take Five Lounge. Hopefully. We're doing something exciting in here. I see it already. It's from Trinidad and Tobago, but of course they started around the Caribbean islands, uh, learning how to make it and stuff like that. We're gonna play a song done by Bob Marley entitled "One Love." Sneak into the casino for a minute. Yeah, y'all quit, quit trying to look in the casino. Gosh, D has got a big win going on something over here. I don't what? Know what it is. At the same time, I got a golden win going over here. Y'all, we crazy. I don't even know what's happening. We got sensational wins. All this gold. Oh well, that's the end of that one. But hey, oh, I finally got you some free games. Excitement. Ooh, look at them gold buffalo heads. Oh, and some more free games. Jackpot, D is doing a lot better than me. <laughs> it's still the same 50. I'm Holy moly. Ooh, D is still on her original $50 investment, so maybe time to take the money and run. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> 
Oh, D is a slot machine champion. Why do we do that very often? I don't There's know. the same $50. I'm really happy. Yeah, you're about 580 up or something like that. So nice. Yeah. We won't talk about me. I might have donated a couple hundred to them buffaloes. But hey, we're still up. Oh, now we're going to do lunch in Capri. Hey. Go oh, check that. Yeah, so we've got a brunch little section, starter soup and salad, burgers and fries. Oh gosh, there's some pastas, mains, desserts. And I forgot, you're not allowed to wear your hat in the dining room, even if you come in here for lunch. So I, they just have to go and look at the little scrubby side of my head today where I have not gotten my daily shower yet, but it's all right. Get our bread and our little butterflowers to get us started. Like this rug, you always like this brown and blue color scheme. Squishy too. Okay, now that I'm full of Indian food, <laughs> which was delicious, we're gonna head up and out to the outside. Outsiding today. Ooh, I feel the breeze. <laughs> the sun is out, so are the folks. Dee has found a nice little, good gracious, coziest seating out here. <laughs> it does feel a little bit like we're sitting in a hot tub out here, no but water. anyway. I like cool. it. There's some kind of like fun in the sun games. Or, oh, look at that strap action that's gonna uh, be coming through. Hey, 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 anyway. I'm trying to shatter this with my big head, but we're out here for games under the stars with Fortuna Luck. Something about, oh, it just went dark. Um, well, A, there's no stars. I mean, there are. We just can't see them because uh, the sun is too bright. You know, it is itself is also a star. Uh, but yeah, something about the screen up there. So 45 minutes, cool. And now we'll just bask in the sun. Oh, they got some little hot tubs one deck up above. They got some hot tubs on this deck too. There's our big movie screen. I'll probably scoot over when the game starts, you know. But anyway. To play trivia while we wait for the games to start. Was the Mona Lisa stolen? I, I don't know. I'm going to say true. Not that, you know, that's an exciting thing, but hey, we got it right. We get steel drum music as a reward. <laughs> oh, we've got some instructions about going to the Games Under the Stars section of the app here when this is ready to begin. Gotcha. So it's under the Play Ocean section. You've also got the whole Ocean Casino section on here. You can gamble with real money while you wait. You've done that before. I have, actually. You won 20 bucks. Funny. <laughs> Oh, yeah, this is where you can make your tag along, which is your little digital friend. They got trivia on deck, games under the stars, snap and share, and a good spirit poker run. What? Well, I have joined the lobby. There are five players ahead of me. Alrighty. We got like 15 minutes to go, so we'll see what this is all about. Alright, I'm confused. Anyway, we were in the middle of an announcement about how if you don't have a uh, device, they have tablets that you can come play this trivia on. And Marcus has come on talking about how we're getting ready to pass some sort of a vehicle called MV McBoatface that's been in Antarctica for like a hundred days and there's a giant ice block. I don't, I think he's making stuff up. I, he's talking about Superman and kal and National Geographic and you can't hear him but we're going to try to figure out what's going on. I wanted to see a ship that's been like exploring Antarctica. He's talking about that you can drink the water and you get superpowers. Okay, I think some, I... Maybe it's an escape. Are we, is this Marvel? Are we all... It's April Fool's. It is April Fool's. Oh, I figured it out. Maybe I'm the only one who knows this. Yeah, you're smart. Okay. You know people are going to be running into that side looking right. for this ship. Yeah, today is April this Fool's is Day, guys. very in-depth. He is still Fool's talking. Yeah, he's talking about, he said like 1.58 p.m. Make sure you're looking out on the port side of the ship and this National Geographic ship is going to go by. No, he's talking about, Tar I don't know, Tarzan? Anyway. Figured it out. Okay. <laughs> April Fool's apparently. A very extended April Fool's from Marcus. When you're at sea, wow. you forget what day it is. I remember. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Bye. I'm excited to see us Hey, Fortuna Luck is right here. Anyone who doesn't know me, I love playing games, all sorts of the games. And these are just some fun digital games. We take about 20 minutes or so to have a good time. Situations. Travel at light 
light speed or get beamed up? I'm gonna travel at light speed. I can go anywhere I want. Do I get younger when you travel at light speed? Isn't there something about that that makes time go backwards? Let's see what's gonna win. Oh, get beamed up. All right, teleportation. Oh, I don't like this one. People get home a dog or adopt a cat. Take home a dog or adopt a cat. You know it's gonna be cat. I bet dog's gonna yes. win though. If I could do both, I would just like to do both and take all of the animals home. Oh, which one's gonna win? What you all voted on. Are they dog people? Dog people. Oh, only 20% of you just all so people right. can Alright, well that was fun. Now we have some kind of a racing game. Oh, that's a lot of you already. Alright, well let's go ahead and get this started again. You can join in at any time. Your tag along is a digital companion. You can personalize it on some of the portals so that by the elevators or in the play ocean area. You can pick between a sea, a sea horse, a turtle, and a fish. And it follows you around the ship. So like, you'll walk by and you'll see it swim by on the little portal. It's really cute and fun. But one of my favorite things to do is race them. Oh, but I see a lot of people on your proverbial tail. Oh, I see when the arrow comes up on the screen, you tap it as fast as you can. Holy moly! That was exciting. I got kicked out of the app, so I don't know that I'm racing, but I, it, it kicked me out. All right, I'm gonna try to get back in and see what happens. Anyway, all right, I got logged back in now. I might be good. Good <laughs> gravy! I won the third race. Yeah, you were you cycled back around, so you got to play again. But anyway, I'm gonna sit these last few out so everybody has a chance to play. All right. Look at all this exciting racing action. We're not playing this round, so I can show a little bit of the scenery. We were in competitive mode before, trying to whoop it. Even though I think she said the prize for this is happiness. Oh, what happened? Oh, a hat started blowing away, I think. So we've won all the happiness we can stand. All right, friends. Halfway through. Another close race. That first place is jumping around quite a bit. I hope that you enjoy whatever it is you do today. There's going to be game shows, there's shows tonight. Um, Nikki and I have Bingo at 3. There's just a lot, but whatever you do, enjoy yourself. My name is Fortuna Luck, and I'll see you all around the ship. Have a great day. Well, now we're going to say goodbye to the outside for a little while. That was fun, though. Boom! Hey! hey. It's food time. And it's fancy night. Fancy <laughs> food time. Now, you know, we don't normally get superly fancily fied, but would you look, would you just look, would you, would you? I made it wear long sleeves. <laughs> the long sleeves and the tie have come back because, you know what, it's they wouldn't princess. even let me eat lunch with a hat on in the dining room. So you know I'm not playing around. I'd say it's more old school cruising, if that's like the term you want to use. I don't like to say that because, you know, cruising you is cruising. But it. it is a little bit um, more fancy, but it's not yeah. like stuffy. Does that make sense? It's more relaxed, yeah. but more classic cruising. That's, that's a good word. I didn't bring yeah. the suit coat, but you no, know. No, anyway. I don't think you're going to see a bunch of that, honestly. And I don't think I had to wear a tie and long sleeves, but I you think know you what? Look oh my gosh. <laughs> well, the food's going to taste just as good. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, we're going to go to dinner in the MDR. We've mm -hmm. got Amalfi again, which yeah. is the aft dining room. We have some of our nights set up for Capri and whatever, whatever. It just depends on what's available. Yeah, but yeah. they're like the same thing. And then they have uh, Santorini, which is, I believe is the fixed time dining room that we will not so. get to look at. But. Let's go eat some food. Yeah. The room keeps making weird prickly noises. <laughs> We're moving a bit. All right, let's go. Right. Welcome to Amalfi. A lot quieter than it was the last time we were here. Oh, I can sit right here by the galley and grab whatever I want when it comes out. <laughs> Speaking of what do we want to grab, what do we want to grab? Okay, there's our starters and salads and soups. Pasta courses, which we never seem to gravitate towards. Mains. Mm -hmm. Camera, why do you keep going boop boop? Anyway. Our seed <laughs> bread with flour butter. The butter's so cute. It is. Dessert 
menu has arrived. There's all your standards down at the bottom. I think they do switch it up. Oh yeah, because it's a caramel pecan turtle cheesecake and a pistachio creme brulee, so a little different. Not sure if the uh, ice cream, now that looks the same as yesterday. There's the main event though. What the heck is gourmandise? This is a Time to jump up a deck. We are headed to Princess Live. Look at the shadow excitement. Princess Live. We're getting ready to have 80s music trivia in here, followed by the Yes No Game Show. Look at that festive decor. It's almost quiz time. <laughs> and you'll have to name the song. Ooh, we got so a couple of different styles of questions here. And then nice. you also get another point for naming the artist. So you can get up to two points for these questions. And then the second type of question is finishing the lyrics. So trivia is over. Boom, we won that bag on trivia. I love music trivia. 49 out of 55. 49 out of 55. It was hard, too. It was good. Yeah, the prize was wine stoppers, so we got two wine stoppers, but the host said, who even needs these? Why would you not drink the entire bottle of wine? And she, she has, has a point. point. <laughs> All right, let's watch Yes, No. I'll probably record a couple of them or something, you know, just for context. I don't feel like playing Yes, No, so we'll, no, we'll watch. I'm not good at it. <laughs> so once you come up, uh, you're going to be over here, I guess, in a hot seat or a hot area, and uh, we're going to converse either with Nikki or myself. This is a regular conversation, and again, you need to last three minutes without saying the words yes or no, but we understand you may have been strategizing a few things here and there, so while your main objective is not saying the words yes or no, there's a few other things in the rule book which you'll need to kind of think about while you're up here. What's one of them, Nikki? So in every minute of our free time, Marcus and I are studying all the different languages in the world, so we know how to say yes and no in every single language, so don't even think about it. We also have this board right behind us over here with the words yes, no, in some languages. <laughs> so you gotta speak English when we converse with you, and uh, another rule is, of course, you cannot keep repeating your answers. You can't keep going affirmative, 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 affirmative. <laughs> yes, and, oh, sorry, I just, I just, <laughs> oopsie. Also, another thing that you cannot do is use any other variation of yes and no. So like, yeah, no, nah, mm-hmm, you can't do that either. Uh, another thing you need to make sure is the conversation needs to flow. So, for example, if we asked you, hey, how are you, and you said... Penguins. That doesn't make sense. <laughs> yeah. So you, you gotta make it make sense. And I think this is the last one, but you also can't nod your head or shake your head. I mean, we'll give you a couple couple chances. We'll give you a couple of strikes for these little small things in the rule book. But the main thing, don't say words yes, no, or yeah, yeah, nah, nah, uh, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> It's the third cruise, everybody. They live here. How does it? Uh, how does it feel watching guests leave and seeing new ones come on? What's that feeling like as a guest? It's very interesting to see the different people. Yes. Go, Marsha, and you are from Florida, correct? Correct. We're in Florida. We live in Winter Haven. Where's that? That's about 35 miles southwest of Disney. So on the East Coast? It's in the center of the state. Center of the state, okay. Who do you live with? I live with my handsome husband, Fred. Hi, Fred! Is he the one that's recording with the camera? That's correct. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he, she's good. Okay. Let's do a Filipino tag team. <laughs> Okay. So, how are you? I'm great. How are you? I'm good. I'm playing this yes no game show. Are you playing the same game? I hope so. <laughs> You're doing fantastic. Thank you. What are your plans tomorrow? Tomorrow we're going to the um, jewelry store. You've been there before? Oh, several times. Which jewelry store? Bellarmine. Ah! Very elegant tonight. Thank you. Where did you get your dress? <laughs> Macy's. Oh, Macy's is a good one to go to. And what about the shoes? I like the sparkly shoes. Macy's. Is Macy's your favorite store? No. Oh. <laughs> 
Ed, you were here last cruise. Absolutely. <laughs> Long time no see. It's been great. We love our cruises. We are Yankee fans in New Jersey. Oh, you are? When's the last time you won the uh, World Series? Oh, not last year. More, right. more recently than the New York Mets. Right. <laughs> what other teams do you root for, anyway? There are no other teams. <laughs> there are no other teams. Today. Um, what was the most exciting thing you did on your very first day? Nothing. <laughs> you did nothing. I rested. You what? I rested. You rested out by the pools on a pool lounger? Out by the pool. So you were tanning? Tanning. Nice. Did you go swimming? No. I oh! <laughs> <laughs> Round of applause for the beautiful town to pick you up on stage. My name is Mark, and we'll see you later on, everybody. Now, we have come back to the cabin to find our patter as well as, I guess, an update from the ports as to which ones you can do ship excursions, independent exploration, and port authorized tours. So it looks like Dominica, for some reason, you can't do independent exploration. So we've got something booked, not through the ship. I'm going to have to find out if we can do it. That would have been helpful to Ooh. know before you board. <laughs> anyway, the updates. Yes, no, yes, no. Oh no, I would be safe. No, yes. <laughs> That's terrible. Well, that's true, you just lost. But anyway, we're back in the cabin. I think we're gonna call it a night. I agree. We've got uh, St. Thomas tomorrow. Are you trying to win the game? Affirmative. Wow, good job. You think you can win? Perhaps. Okie dokie. Not gonna play that. But anyway, we're back in the cabin, so ready for bed. Correct. Oh, you got some work to do? I do. Okay, good enough. Lots. Did you have fun? How was your dinner? It was amazing. Yeah? Really good. You really have to think about it. I enjoyed answers. everything I ate. Uh, but anyway, St. Thomas tomorrow. We're excited. We're going to have a good time. We are. That's all I know. Yeah. Except now I'm standing oh. here. <laughs> yeah, she lost. Uh, but anyway, bedtime. So we'll see y'all. Thanks for hanging out today. Thanks, guys. Um, that's it. Mm -hmm. See you tomorrow from St. Thomas. See you then. Good night. Bye.